Hi everyone, this is Lisa from Canine Clips, and this is Riley, and Riley is a Yorkshire Terrier who is about 10 years old and uh, about 4 pounds. And uh, I've already started the grooming process on him with the face, feet, and uh, area, but uh, on the feet I noticed he's very resistant to getting his nails done and feet done, so I just wanted to show you a little video on how I work with him on that. Um, he is quite small and um, he doesn't like his feet being done. So I just wanted to show you how I work with him on that. So basically, is um, I just allow him to move around and uh, eventually he will settle. And then I just go with, uh, with him at that time and get my stuff done around the feet. So I'm going to trim up his feet. And then I'm going to do his nails as well. There, give you a little closer view. He has a little bit of hair in there. I'm just going to get that out. And uh, it's important um, when you're grooming, you just kind of hold on. And just keep working on what you need to work on. So that they know that um, it has to get done. It's okay. So sometimes it's just waiting them out. But it's important to keep holding on so that if he's moving around, um, it's at his comfort level so that he's not injuring himself. Of course, you don't want him flailing too much. Um, but you don't want him to injure himself. But you have to get this done as well. So I just have my whole hand around his paw. But I'm not holding on too tightly. Hey, come on, it's okay. His feet are a little bit sensitive, as you can see. And we just keep maneuvering with him until eventually he will let me do it. This is his only his second time being groomed with me. Okay. And there we go. So now for the nails. And it's the same, same process. He's not too fond of me doing his nails. But I don't have to take off very much. So he does put his mouth on me, but he's not actually biting. So that's why I'm not too concerned with it. Just kind of wait him out again. Come on, baby. It's okay. It's okay. Gotta get your nails done. And that's the one thing with the little guys, they can uh, really maneuver quite around quite a bit and quite quickly. So it's really hard to uh, sometimes trim their nails or their feet because they do squirm around a bit. So again, it's just kind of trying different positions with them. I'm going to put his body a little closer to mine so I can kind of hold him a little bit. That's okay. It's okay, Riley. And there we go. So that was one box. And as he gets used to coming to me, 
he'll realize that um, although he's squirming around, um, it doesn't uh, doesn't allow me to stop, and it doesn't encourage me to stop. So um, they soon realize that it's just something that they have to get done, and they will calm down with you eventually. Um, but there are some dogs that just stay anxious and nervous the whole time. And you just got to find what works with them and just go at their pace. Well, because he's putting his mouth near his feet, I just also got to be careful of where the scissors are, of course. So if you like this video and want to see more types of videos like this, uh, please subscribe to my channel. And uh, you can, I definitely have lots of videos of different types of grooming or specific uh, areas that uh, I do on different dogs and different dog breeds. You can always also make a comment in any of the videos and let me know if there's something specific you'd like to see. I kind of use my fingers to deflect them there a little bit. Okay. That'll be good for now. Okay. It's okay. Okay. Again, it's just persistence. So he is biting the clippers right now. Showing me he does not like them. That's okay, really. It's okay. They'll whine and yelp. That doesn't mean you're hurting them. He's just getting fed up with me right now. Hey. Okay. And that's how they get out of it any other time is that uh, they'll yelp and then the owner or another vet or the groomer will stop. So then they've just uh, learned that if they yelp, um, you'll stop doing their nails. So just uh, I kind of got to break that with him. So he's trying a little bit more nipping now because the yelping is not working. There we go. You just have to trim a little bit off his because they actually are nice, fairly nice way. Okay. It's okay. Hey. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, baby. Just one more. One more and you're all done. There. Good boy. All right. So that is just showing you the process of cutting some nails and putting the feet on a dog that is quite resistant. So it can be done, but it just takes a little bit more time. And it kind of wears them down a little bit. Um, but he'll be okay. We'll give him some water here and uh, just let him rest for a bit because now I'm going to just um, give him a bath now. So I just wanted to show you this process on just uh, clipping the nails of a dog that's a little bit nervous and uh, who really doesn't like their feet being uh, done. So thanks for taking the time to watch and hope you subscribe to my channel and I hope you have a great day. Thanks.